Okay, here or what? We're going to call up with our first class at 110. That is about 13 minutes away. We'll fire the engines for our first class for top trials here today. That'll be Junior 3 Heavy. Junior 3 Heavy, be getting ready.
Junior three heavy, first class to qualify. We're firing the engines in less than eight minutes. Need those first couple of groups to have your carts ready to make your way down to the grid. Group A, Cordell, Denton, Warren, Ellerby, and Ridley. Group B, Riddle, Lewis, Everett, McClellan, and Fulton. We're getting ready to get underway with qualifying. Junior three heavy, first class out, have those carts ready. That'll be followed by junior two heavy, rookie prelude, and then the junior wing heat race. The junior three heavy, again, first class out, be getting your carts ready. Group A and B, you can start making your way down here to the grid. Rest of the class have those carts ready to go. We will fire the engines now in less than seven minutes for class number one. First class out, Junior 3 Heavy, need to be making your way on the grid. If you're not already there, we're firing the engines for our first group. Less than three minutes, Junior 3 Heavy to the grid. Junior 3 Heavy, first out. 
You should be here, ready to qualify. Junior three heavy. Junior two heavy. Rookie prelude and then junior wing heat race. He's getting them ready. Junior three heavy, you should be here. Two minutes, guys. Last call to the grid for Junior 3 Heavy for qualifying. Last call, Junior 3 Heavy should be here for qualifying. Junior 2 Heavy, have your cars ready. Second class to go, Junior 2 Heavy, have them ready. We're getting ready to fire the engines for class number one. Junior 3 Heavy again, last call down here to the grid. Looking for 22 of you here for our first class for qualifying.
First group of the day on track for qualifying here for Junior 3 Heavy. 317 of Jaden Cordell, 15 of Troy Warren, and the 81 of Riker Ridley. And it was Ridley quickest in the first group, 11.113 by 59, one thousandths of a second over Jaden Cordell for the top spot here through three of 22 in Junior 3 Heavy. Again, our next class out, Junior 2 Heavy. You need to have your carts ready, Junior 2 Heavy. We're rolling our second group now. The Junior 3 Heavy Qualifier. Second group coming to green. Thomas Everett. Cart 9. Lance Lewis in the 7. Dawson McClellan. Cart 80. Hannah Fulton in the 13. J.R. New quick lap, Brayson Riddle, cart 96, top of the chart, 11.001 on his first lap. Coming around to Checkered Hill, picking up in a big way, 10.848. And now by a quarter of a second, out of your second group, Brayson Riddle. Out of Easley, South Carolina, cart 96 through eight of them. Riddle. Riker Ridley, Jaden Cordell, Thomas Everett out of that group fourth, 11.295 for the nine of Thomas Everett. And our third group coming to green now. Regan Scholten, 9S, Logan Walston, 56, Carly Bennett in 10. Cooper Kidd, cart 28, making up this group. Walston going to go second spot in first lap around. Logan Walston, 11.092. And a good pickup on lap two for Walston, 10.894. He'll stay second on the board. Fastest of the group. Brayson Riddle still fastest of them all now by 46 thousandths over new second place man Logan Walston. 12 qualified, 10 left to go here in our first class of the day. Next class out, Junior 2 Heavy. Let's start making your way to the grid. Junior 2 Heavy. Daniel Cole, 629 into the top five, 11119. Good enough for the fifth spot. Kyler Bronson, the sixth. We'll stay the same. Top of the board stays Brayson Riddle and Logan Walston in your top two spots. With just five drivers left to qualify in junior three heavy. Still the mark to beat. 10.848 for card 96 Brayson Riddle. We've got our next group coming here. Junior 2 Heavy, Junior 2 Heavy, you should be at the grid at this time. Next on the racetrack, Junior 2 Heavy. Junior 2 Heavy should be here. Next group to qualify, Charlie Coker, card five. Landon Gatlin in the four. Clay Bellamy in card 22. Mason Hudson in double zero.
Clay Bellamy, car 22, second spot, 10.874. And Landon Gatlin with a good run there as well. He'll go fourth. And that's going to do it for Junior 3 Heavy. So Grayson Riddle, car 96, going to take the first quick time of the day. He'll best the 22 car field there for Junior 3 Heavy. Coming up next should be in the grid Junior 2 Heavy. That'll be followed by Rookie Prelude and then our Junior Wing Heat Rays. Our second class of the day for qualifying. Just wrapping up their first group, Junior 3 Heavy. It's Bryson Smith in the first session. 11.000. 11 flat for the two. Just over a tenth of a second over Aubrey Ice, Cart 88. 11.126. Good enough for second. Grayson Underwood, Dylan Trost, Brody Warren. Your order after the first group. Rookie Prelude and the Junior Wing Heat Race need to be getting ready. New quick time, Hudson Barrett, 94B, 10.950, half a tenth better than the two of Bryson Smith. Now bump back to second. Assets of the group there, 151. Cowboy Carter going to go third spot overall, 
Your top two stay the same. Hudson Barrett and Bryson Smith through 15 of 22 timers for Junior 2 Heavy. You know, rookie prelude class making your way to the grid. You're next to qualify, followed by our Junior Wing Heat Race, and then back to qualifying Junior 1 Heavy be getting ready. Next group here, Wesley Roberson, the 1X. Declan Willis in the 100. Foster Smithies, cart nine. John Hensley, cart nine. Tucker Polizic. And John Hensley going to go third. Foster Smithies to fifth here. And Hensley going to be quickest of the group, 11.018. Still nothing for those top two, though. Hudson Barrett and Bryson Smith. He had Smith there at 11 flat. Hudson Barrett at a 10.95. Hensley there, 11.018. So make it 68 thousandths off the quick time of Hudson Barrett. This will be your final group of timers, Junior 2 Heavy. They're going to wrap up their runs, and no big moves there at the top of the board. So, Hudson Barrett, 10 9 tops them all in Junior 2 Heavy. Hudson Barrett with a quick time. Bryson Smith, John Hensley, your top three there. And we're just about ready to go with our next class for qualifying. Rookie Prelude. Rookie Prelude should be there for qualifying Junior Wing for your heat race. You can start making your way towards the grid area. This Rookie Prelude qualifying group going to go quick here. We've got just six of them. Should be just two groups here. First group coming to green. Cam Crawford. Cart number two along with Sawyer Chavis in the 86. Diesel Hobbs, card number five. Taking up our first group, the Red Platers. Junior Wing should be down at the grid for your heat race, followed by Junior One Heavy for qualifying. We need both those classes down there. Junior One Heavy should be making your way. Junior Wing, need to be making your way in the grid for your heat race. Junior Wing, Junior Wing, heat race. Next out.
And our Junior Wing Heat race coming up next, followed by Junior One Heavy and Stock Super Heavy for qualifying. Getting ready to go with an eight lap heat race here for the junior wing division. Need junior one heavy. Stock super heavy and stock heavy getting ready for qualifying. Next on the racetrack will be an eight lapper to set the field for the 20 lap main, the junior wing division here today. Gonna have five of them for this one. Junior one heavy, you can be making your way down towards the grid for qualifying. Junior one heavy. Five cars for eight laps here. Again, to set the field for their 20 lap main for the Junior Wings. Jackson Darnell in the sixth from the inside of the front row. Going to bring them off turn four. And no, nope, not going to go that time. We did not go green. They didn't like what they saw there, so we'll go try that one again. Jackson Darnell, Jaden Cordell. 
from second. Outside of row one, car 317. Kevin Musgrave, car 53 from third. Tyler Buzzy, 99 from fourth. And Liam Kane from fifth in the 29. Next class to qualify. Junior one heavy needs you making your way in the grid area. Super heavy and stock heavy be getting ready. Green flag is out underway and it's the six. Jackson Darnell bringing him down turn two and down the back. With the lead, Darnell strong out front as we've got a spin off turn four. Out one around back of the field. And caution, yellow light was well, displayed there. They were trying to see if that one was going to get back going. All right, so we did not get a lap in there with our original double file attempt. So we'll go single file here for the restart. Jackson Darnell, Jaden Cordell, Kevin Musgrave. And we're going to try them again here. Eight laps the distance. They look good on turn four. Green back in the air as the six going to rock it away by Cartley down the back of the turn three and four, but they'll close it right back up off turn four. Cordell's there to the back bumper with just one lap complete. They'll break away from the field. Jackson Darnell and Jaden Cordell hooked up there at the draft, trying to pull away with two complete now. Cordell reels to the back bumper there in three and four. Takes a peek to the inside. Not quite enough to get there. He'll keep it in second. Don't look now. Here comes Kevin Musgrave. Quick lap of the race last time by 11.131. He'll close the gap down for second. Now we'll have a three-card battle up here at the front. Musgrave going to dive to the inside of Cordell in turn three and four. He'll muscle his way up to second, but it's going to cost him both time. Now here comes the 99, looking to make it three wide into turn one. And all this great news for Jackson Darnell as he'll pull away from the field off turn four. Half a straightaway advantage now for car number six. Darnell, Jaden Cordell, Tyler Buzzy up to third. And they'll be coming to check her this time by a dominating run for the six of Jackson Darnell. Started out front and took it by a half a straightaway there at the checker with Jaden Cordell coming home in second. Tyler Buzzy, third. Liam Kane, fourth. And getting ready to get back with qualifying. Junior one heavy should be at the grid. Junior one heavy. 
Stock super heavy can start making your way towards the grid. Stock super heavy will take carts down here for qualifying. Stock super heavy. See you. Finally, want to get. Junior one heavy, cart five of Camden Harp, early mark to beat 11.696. Adam covered in the first group over three tenths of a second over the 31X of Bladed Wheeler, right now second. Second group on the racetrack, Paxton Miller, cart 53, Levi Helton in the 5H. Grayson Redleaf in the 7G. Raylan Morris in the 89. Morris going to go second spot, first lap around. 11.926 for Raylan Morris. Here, that one comes off turn four, wrapping up the run. Picks it up almost 11.704. That's eight thousandths of a second short of that cart five of Harp. So still Camden Harp through nine qualifiers quickest with a mark to meet 11.696. Rayanne Gibbs, card 57, lays down a good first lap, third spot, 11.892. And picks it up, second lap, 11.711. Rayanne Gibbs, fastest of the group. She'll go third. Braden Chavis going to go to fourth, card 94, 11.791. The driver out of Hepsibah, Georgia. Camden Harp out of that first group still holding on 11.696. We've got just a couple groups to go in this one. Need stock super heavy making your way down to the grid if you have not done so. Stock super heavy next out to qualify. Let's be putting them down here. Stock heavy and then heat racing for the box stock wings.
Got a new quick time in this one. Caleb Nibel, 18 in, 11.5, 1, 2, by almost a tenth of a second. As we got a new second place man as well, Brock Anderson. So your top two coming out of this group bumping Camden Hart back to third. And that will do it for Junior One Heavy. So Caleb Nibel, 11 5 1 2. He takes the quick time for that one. Brock Anderson, Camden Harp, Raylan Morris, and Ray Ann Gibbs for your quick five. And coming up next to qualify, Stock Super Heavy, overdue at the grid, the should wheel, be huh? there. Yeah, Stock I've been Heavy. For three years, and I've never got to drive. Well, you're going to need some more gear than just your helmet. Why don't you go to shopakr.com? They got their inventory online, and they'll ship it the same day if you order before 5.30 p.m. Eastern. They got shoes? Yep. Gloves? Yep. Rim protectors? Got those, too. Can they make me go fast? No. Here at Acceleration Kart Racing, we've got everything you need to get on track. What happens next? Well, that's on you. Check us out online at shopakr.com. Point eight five four fastest with Wendell Chavis second. Colin Malugan, cart number ten third, and the second group coming to green. Daniel Shacklett, the fourteen D Hunter Scarborough, the fourteen Mike Melton in cart five.
And now through 18 qualifiers in this one, Josh Carter, 10.715. With Donnie Nall second, Coltrane Plumber still holding on to third. Next group on track taking time, A.J. Pace, part 88. Three amps in the 28, Ryan Hebner, part 7. And Ty Bennett in the 122 as they're coming to Tucker. Ryan Hebner, quickest of that last group. He'll go third spot overall, 10.814 for cart number seven. Branch Krugs right now sitting fifth with a mark of 10.879. Window Chape is sixth. Tim O'Connor, seventh. With 27 drivers signed up for this one. We said we will send three to the house, top 24 in times to the main. Through 22 of 27 timers here. Well, no. I think we got some misinformation. We are going to start all 27 for this one. We will start all 27 for the main event. Mitchell Bridges, card 15, goes 13th on the board, 10.998, first lap around. Rob Sanders going to go all the way to fourth, great second lap for the 44, 10.835. Rob Sanders into the top five here, and we've got just three left to time. Josh Carter, Donnie Nall, Ryan Hebner, Rob Sanders, Coltrane Palmer. Your quick five and super heavy. We need stock heavy. Make it your way to the grid. You're next to time in. Stock heavy. Next out. Here at MPG Motorsports, our main goal is to provide the best pathway into professional motorsports for our entire team, drivers and mechanics alike. We're based out of Whiteland Raceway Park in Indiana. For more information, contact us at chase at mpg-motorsports.com. Studies show 
Even the best current generation of simulators only convince 50% of the human brain that they are real. And here at SimCraft, that just isn't realistic enough. Developed to offer the most realistic karting sim experience in the world, all testing has shown that the physics engine used in SimCraft's Grid 1 model convinces 90% of the human brain that you are actually on track. Now that is the real deal. Right now to qualify stock heavy. We've got 43 drivers for 24 spots for the main event. 24 going to make it. 19 going to be watching for the fence. We'll see who's going to get there. Coming to checkered. First group. First group for stock heavy, 40 of Chase Williamson, fastest of them all, 10.523 by 19, one thousandth of a second. Over Daniel Simmons in cart 06, who was second with a mark of 10.542. Cameron Lambert, Carson Hallman, and Jennifer Seawright, your order after the first group. Again, 43 drivers for 24 spots for this one. And our second group coming to green. Ashton Starnes, cart 22, Rodney Ice in 88, Tristan Jones, cart 62, A.J. Miller in the 548, Jonathan Draper in the 4D, Rodney Ice into the top five, first lap, 10.656. Top four, stay safe. Through the second group there. Williamson, Simmons, Lambert, Hallman, and Rodney Ice through 10 of them. Austin Yarbrough to the top of the board, 10.346. We're in the 705 here this weekend. Austin Yarbrough, Ethan Endicott going to go second, and Thomas Underwood to third, just like that. Williamson going to get bumped all the way down to fourth. New quick mark to be here in stock heavy. Austin Yarbrough out of Little River, South Carolina, 10.346.
Brantley Carter going to go second spot, 10.441 for the Jay Carter logging back to 151 machine. The youngster in the 151 going to make it a South Carolina top two right now in stock heavy. Again, we will be locking in 24 to the main. 43 carts, 24 spots. Just another group or so. We will start the bump process here in stock heavy as we're 20 drivers in. Quick to the group there, Andrew Dove going to go fifth spot, 10.470. The driver of cart number four, Mikey Kaiser to sixth. Looks to be safely in the show, 10.523. Right now on the bubble, spot number 24 sits A.J. Miller with a mark of 10.894. And so Austin Yarbrough, the one to be 10.346, sitting top of the board for stock heavy. Neil Armstrong and Josh Darnell both laid down good enough laps to put it in the show. Armstrong right now 12. Josh Darnell sitting 15. Jennifer Seawright, Tristan Jones, Colin Stevenson all been bumped for the show here. Also, Avery Franklin and A.J. Miller. Not going to have enough to make the A main for this one. Field coming around a checkered on this group. Passes to that last group, Shea Chavis. And the Matt Connell back to cart 811. And a 10.487. Good enough for the sixth spot. Now on the bubble, Ashton Starnes at a 10.672. The veteran Baratari not going to have enough to make the show here in stock heavy. Right now sitting 27th on the board after his run. Cole Johnson, 17th on lap one. Jacob Nibel, fourth spot, 10.449 for Jacob Nibel. And now Cole Johnson going to jump all the way to second. Great second lap there for the fireball. Cole Johnson, 10.432. So Johnson to second, Jacob Nibel to fifth. That's going to put Sam Platt on the bubble right now. 10.651 or better is what it's going to take to make the field here.
Drivers in danger of missing the show. Platson in 24th. Carson Holman, 23rd. Cameron Lambert, 22nd. All these guys looking to knock them out of the show. And Justin Dobson, Colin McAllister. Timmy Price. And nobody in that group going to have the speed to make the race. They are all out of the top 24. And that's going to do it. Stock heavy. Wrapping up Austin Yarbrough at a 10.346 second lap. We'll take the stock heavy quick time. In top 24 to the band for Stock Heavy. Next out going to be Box Stock Wing for their eight-lap heat race. Box Stock Wing should be down here at the grid. Rookie, followed by Junior 3, Max Daddy Prelude, and Junior 1, Max Daddy Prelude. Be getting ready. Off turn four and green flag is out. Eight lap heat race for the box stock wings. Off a of turn two is the 44 of Zoe Smith taking the top spot here early. Smith leads the charge off a of turn four. We'll get that first lap in clean and green. Zoe Smith, Drake Edwards, Raylan Morris, top three. Morris looking for more down the back. He'll look to the inside in turn three and four. Muscles that second spot away as we got one in trouble off a of turn four. It's the zero three around. With one lap complete here, Drake Edwards, who started from the top spot, finding trouble off a of turn four. Edwards going to be going tail here, and we'll line him back up for a restart with one lap complete. Back to green and a new leader off a of turn four. Raylan Morris has found his way to the front from his third starting spot. It didn't take him long. Morris to the point. Liam Kane to second. Liam Kane having a good run here early. Now three complete. Zoe Smith, who led this one early, finds himself in third. Under pressure for that spot. Here comes Gabe Yakimo in the 28 to the inside to pick one up at turn three. Yakimo to third and now looking for second. That 28 is strong. Here he comes down low. 
Looking for second. He'll take it away in three and four. Five down, three to go. He's got a fast ride. Does he have enough time to get there? Morris still has a good commanding advantage right now as they'll be coming to two to go this time off turn four. Two to go signal from flagman Jerry Strickland. They'll be seeing white flag in the air this time off of turn four. Braylon Morris from third on the grid, leading them with a lap to go. Here in the heat race for the box stocks. Morris going to wheel it down through turn number three and four. Checkered flag is out. Raylan Morris going to take the win. Gabe Yakamo for second. Liam Kane, Zoe Smith, Bryson Reinhardt, and Drake Edwards as they'll finish them up there. The heat race for the box stock wings. Our rookie division should be in the grid next for qualifying. Junior three, Max Daddy Prelude. Junior one, Max Daddy Prelude for top trials. Be getting ready. We're at a commercial break. Rookie okay, red plate qualifying now. Our second and what's going to be final group on the racetrack. Our next class to qualify, Junior 3 Max Daddy Prelude should be in the grid area. Junior 3 Max Daddy Prelude. Still missing a good bit of you down here. Junior 3 Max Daddy Prelude next out. Are you looking for an advantage in your competition? 
or car class has done the hard work for you. We've travelled to your racetracks to give you the inside knowledge. So what does car class offer? We've got drone footage that captures the racing lines, visual markers for your braking points, acceleration zones and the best overtake opportunities on your racetrack, pedal cam to show you where to brake and when to accelerate, and 360 degree footage to make sure you don't miss any parts on the racetrack. We've covered 13 racetracks in the United States. And Australia, you're up next. So visit carclass.com to get your track information. Are you ready to get behind the wheel? From Formula One to NASCAR and IndyCar, all the pros start here. more information, check us out online at mccarting.com or call us and go racing today. You need it? We got it. At Cart Eat Parts, we are your complete online aftermarket cart part superstore. From chains to bearings to bumpers and components, we've got it in stock and ready to ship straight to your door from our base in Ontario, Canada. Check us out online at carteparts.ca. Got 24 drivers for 20 spots for the Junior 3 Max Daddy Prelude here today. Early on, Regan Schultz and Quickest, as I say that, Brace and Riddle going to knock that back to second. Riddle, 11.165, showing a lot of speed here today. Jaden Cordell going to go third spot, 11.283. Riddle picks it up, second lap around Newmark to be 10.992. Got him covered by two tenths of a second. Brace and Riddle over the rest of the field through 13 qualifiers. Make it 25 drivers for 20 spots here. 
through about half the qualifiers. Grayson Riddle, Regan Shelton, Landon Gatlin, Jaden Cordell, and Gracie Miller, fifth spot. Riker Ridley in the 81 goes second spot first lap around to 11.201. Now Cooper Kidd going to go second. Ridley going to best that lap. He'll go back to second. Carly Bennett going to go third with a great pickup on lap two. Carly Bennett, 11.142. Good enough for the third spot. So Ridley to second. Bennett to third. Kidd to fourth. But still bracing Riddle quickest of them all. 10.992. Still fastest through 17 qualifiers. New quick time out of this group, Logan Walston, 10.976 to bump Grayson Riddle off the top spot. Daniel Cole in the 629, going to go ninth on the board. Holden Myers, 11th and into the show. And we will start 20 for this one. And that's going to do it for the qualifier for the Junior 3 Max Daddy Prelude. Logan Walston out of the last group, 10.976. Grayson Riddle, Riker Ridley, Carly Bennett, and Cooper Kidd. The rest of your top five for Junior 3. Got Junior 1 coming up next. Junior 1 Max Daddy Prelude should be at the grid. Junior 2s. And stock super heavy Max Daddy Prelude. First call for qualifying. Be getting ready. Walker Elliott in the 14, quickest here early. For the junior one, Max Teddy Prelude. This will be our second group on the racetrack now. 
Peter Junior 2 is making your way down here to the grid. Junior 2, Max Daddy Prelude next out. Followed by a Super Heavy and then the Max Daddy Prelude qualifying. In that last group, we changed the top three spots. Caleb Nibel now fastest, 11 4 2 7. Braden Chavis and Rayanne Gibbs making up your top three. Walker Elliott now bumped back to fourth. Next group coming to green. 7G Grayson Redleaf. 48 of Carver Posey. 25, Lug Nut Denat. That's a good one. 89 of Raylan Morris and the two of Ellie Jewell. Raylan Morris, fourth on the first lap, 11.688. And he'll go to second lap, two, 11.506 for Raylan Morris. Yep. Just two drivers left to qualify. Caleb Nibel, still with the lap to beat, 11.427. 79,000 is better than Raylan Morris for second. Good qualifying run for Camden Harp there. We'll wrap it up for Junior 1 Max Daddy. He'll go fourth spot. 11-6-3-0. So give it to Caleb Nibel. Nibel over Raylan Morris, Braden Chavis, Camden Harp, and Rayanne Gibbs. Your past five for Junior 1 Max Daddy Prelude. Junior 2 Prelude should be in the grid. Super Heavy Prelude and Max Daddy Prelude have them ready. John Hensley passes after the first group for Junior 2, Max Daddy Prelude. Hensley with a mark of 11.082. Colin Stewart second, T Tucker Polisic third. Chase Chance, Brody Moore in your current order.
Super Heavy, Max Daddy Prelude. Need to start making your way to the grid. Super Heavy to the grid. Aubrey Ice going to jump to second on the board. Cart 88 mark of 11.094. Making an Alabama top two as it stands. John Hensley and Aubrey Ice in first and second. Hudson Barrett, Dylan Tross, Colin Stewart. The rest of your top five through 14 qualifiers. Next out to qualify, 94, Lawson Bryant, 151, Cowboy Carter, 12 of Cruz Plutz, 100 of Declan Willis, and the 15 of Foster Smithies. Foster Smithies, sixth spot, first lap around, 11.244. Lawson Bryant to third spot, 11.126. And new quick time, Declan Willis, 11.030. Going to best of all, Declan Willis. Out of South Boston, Virginia, now fastest through 19 qualifiers. Bryson Smith going third spot as first lap around. Second lap going to best them all. New quick time coming out of the last group for junior two. Bryson Smith, 11 flat, 11.000. It'll be Bryson Smith for first. Declan Willis, Aubrey Ice, Lawson Bryant, and Foster Smithies. Top five here in junior two. Got our super heavy Max Daddy Prelude qualifying coming up next. Max Daddy Prelude qualified, and then Junior One Max Daddy qualified. First call for that one. Be getting ready.
Josh Carter, quickest here early in super heavy prelude qualifying, 10.949. New top two coming out of that second group there. Mitch Hendricks now fast as 10.820 with Wendell Chavis second. Pushing Josh Carter back to third. And our third group taking the green now. Cody Thomason in the 14 T. Rob Sanders in card 44. Tim O'Connor in the 119. Hunter Scarborough in 14. Tim O'Connor to the top five first lap, 10.968. Good enough for the fourth spot. Down through three and four. O'Connor wrapping up his run. And he'll go quickest. New quick time for Tim O'Connor. 10.791. Rob Sanders with another solid qualifying run here today. Right now sitting fourth. O'Connor, Hendricks, Chavis, Sanders, and Carter. Top five through 14 timers. Now to make their run, Daniel Shacklett, the 14D, Monk Newsom in 99, Ryan Hefner in 7, Dalton Davis, 51X, and Ty Bennett in the 122. Ryan Hefner, ninth on lap 1, 11.099. And he'll pick it up to 6th on lap 2, 10.973. I'll make that seven. Ty Bennett going to go third overall. Ty Bennett, 10.857. Great second lap there for the 122. Passes to the group third overall now through 19 timers. Still Tim O'Connor, quickest of them all at a 10.791. Sixth spot, lap one for A.J. Pace in part 88, 10.911. Jared Beasley also up into the top five. He'll go fourth at a 10.884. That makes 23 of them now, and still Tim O'Connor. And a 10.791 by 29 thousandths for Mitch Hendricks. Running all fourth spot, lap one, 10.883. And he'll bump it all the way to second, second lap around 10.797 for Donnie Nall. Austin Wyatt going to be good enough for ninth out of 10.912.
And that's going to do it for Super Heavy. Tim O'Connor taking the top spot, 10.791 in the Shane Bass Prepared. Card number 119, Tim O'Connor, Donnie Nall, Mitch Hendricks, Ty Bennett, Jared Beasley. Your Fast Five and Super Heavy. Max Daddy Prelude, you're qualified next. We need you down here in the grid. Max Daddy Prelude. Junior one, Max Daddy qualifying. Be getting ready. That's coming up. Right now, looking for our Max Daddy drivers. Max Daddy Prelude down here to the grid. Qualifying is next. Looking for 46 carts and drivers down here. 46 carts and drivers for 24 spots. Quick time for Chase Williamson. First lap around 10.570. Second lap around even better. 10.484. Williamson to first. Bradley Carter going to go second at a 10.570. Stephen Adams also into the top five. Make it fourth spot for the 92. 
Driver out of Four Oaks, North Carolina. A lap time of 10.607 for Stephen Adams. Cole Johnson going to go second spot, 10.486, just two thousandths off the 40 of Chase Williamson. Austin Banker going to go third, and Josh Darnell to fourth. So a lot of speed coming out of that group there, but still Chase Williamson. Hey, hold on here. Four. Hey, oh, we got a good smell. Hey. Now through 19 of what's going to be 46 timers for this one. Again, we'll take the top 24 to the main. Another great qualified run here today for the Nibel boys. Jacob Nibel, 18 in third spot, fastest of the group, 10.538 seconds. With this next group, we will start the bump process. Again, top 24 in time. Going to go to the main event for this one. That means 22 going to be sent packing here for the Max Daddy Prelude. Right now, they're all still trying the best part. 40, Chase Williamson, 10.484. Case and Sinclair, 14th on the chart, 10.790. Austin Yarbrough now 14th for the 705, not the run he was looking for, 10.759. That will bump Timmy Price, Noah Barrett, Jeremy Cox, Jason Scrubs, Colin Stevenson, all for the show. Right now on the bubble sits Jennifer Seawright with a mark of 11.253. It's still Chase Williamson, Cole Johnson, Jacob Nibel. Austin Banker and Josh Darnell, your top five now through 29 in the Max Daddy Prelude qualifying. 
Junior one Max Daddy, be getting ready. Junior one Max Daddy for qualifying, be getting ready. Daniel Simmons is going to go 16th on the board. Shea Chavis, 15th. So in the show, but not the speed they're looking for. No big moves at the top of the chart through that group. On the bubble right now sits Hunter Adams at a 10.987. Sam Platt, Cody Strange, Avery Franklin getting bumped for the show there. Junior one Max Daddy be getting ready for qualifying. It's next on track. Junior one Max Daddy be getting ready. Daniel Armstrong going to lay down a lap, good enough for 13th spot, 10.719 into the show. That's going to put Bryson Murray on the bubble at a 10.820. So the lap getting better and better. What it's going to take to make this race right now at 10.82 in the 24th spot. Ashton Starnes going to get bumped from the show. Also, Barrett Terry going to get bumped from this one. Tyler Blasek not going to have enough to make the show for here. We got our next group coming to white. Carson Cox, 11.198 on his first lap. That's not going to be enough. All these drivers looking for speed to try to get into the show. Good lap for Andrew Duff. They're 11th spot, 10.678. And that's going to be good enough to race here today for the Backstanding Prelude. Top 10 stays safe. And this is going to be your last two timers for the Max Daddy Prelude. 13 of Justin Dobson and the 548 of AJ Miller trying to find their way into the show. And they're both going to need some speed. Dobson 11301 on his first lap. Miller was a 238. Coming to the checkered. And they're not going to have enough. Miller going to go 34th on the chart. Dobson right with him at 35th. That will do it for the Max Daddy Prelude Qualifier. Chase Williamson going to best the field there at a 10-4-8-4. Taking the top spot over Cole Johnson, Jacob Nibel, Austin Banker, and Josh Darnell. Top five for the Max Daddy Prelude. Six through ten was Bradley Carter, Ethan Endicott, Steve Brady, Adams, you know. Braden Parsley, and yes. Cooper Quick. All right, we will be taking just a few minutes here before we qualify this next class. Junior one, Max Danny, 
You should have your carts ready. You can start making your way towards the grid. It's not going to be long at all, guys. Five minutes. Junior one, Max Daddy. Have your carts ready to qualify. Start making your way towards the grid area. That'll be followed by Junior two, and then Junior three. Have them ready. We're at a commercial break. Are you looking for an advantage in your competition? Well, Car Class has done the hard work for you. We've traveled to your racetracks to give you the inside knowledge. So what does Car Class offer? We've got drone footage that captures the racing lines, visual markers for your braking points, acceleration zones, and the best overtake opportunities on your racetrack, pedal cam to show you where to brake and when to accelerate, and 360 degree footage to make sure you don't miss any parts on the racetrack. We've covered 13 racetracks in the United States. And Australia, you're up next. So visit carclass.com to get your track information. Are you ready to get behind the wheel? From Formula One to NASCAR and IndyCar, all the pros start here. Check us out online at mccarting.com or call us and go racing today. if you would take a look around where you're standing right now somebody's lost a set of four-wheeler keys they would really like to get back if you see a set of keys on the ground if you take them over to the tech area please somebody losing their four-wheeler keys i believe here just in the last few minutes so take a look if you would our next class to qualify junior one max daddy should be making your way down towards the grid junior one max daddy for qualifying be making your way down
folks, just to let you know, when we complete qualifying here today, we will have a race for the juice box carts. We didn't forget you guys. We want to get you on the racetrack. We want to see your action, see your race you put on for us. The juice box, you're going to go after the completion of qualifying, and we will have two consies for the Max Daddy class. We'll run those after the qualifying session, after the juice box. Give you guys a few minutes to get them turned back around. Those will be the only two consies here today. We'll have two quick consies. Max Daddy. And right now we need Junior One Max Daddy making your way down here to the grid. If you're not already here, Junior One Max Daddy, they need you. We're ready to get back to it. First group in the books for the Junior One Max Daddy qualifying. Brianne Gibbs in the one X quickest, eleven point seven four two. Ellie Jewell second. Walker Elliott right now third. Second group coming around the green is Camden Harp in cart five. Carver Posey in the forty eight. Grayson Redleaf in the seven G is Harp going to go second spot first lap around Camden Harp eleven point seven six five. Coming up off turn four to wrap up his run to the start finish. New quick time. Camden Harp, 11.513 by over two tenths of a second. Camden Harp down through 10 qualifiers. Quickest in junior one Max Daddy time trials. Raylan Morris to second on the first lap, 11.714. Caleb Dival to fourth. Now Nibel going to jump to the second spot, 11.552 for Caleb Nibel. Thank you. 
Still Camden Hart, the one to beat, 11-5, 1-3 on the watch through 14 timers. Just four drivers left to go here for Junior 1. Junior 2, Max Daddy. Junior 2, Max Daddy qualifying is next. We need you down here to the grid. Junior 2, Max Daddy to the grid. That's going to be our final four timers for this one on the track. Now, Wendon Shaw going to go eighth on the first lap, 11 8 Brandon Chavis now into the top five, 11 7 4 0 for cart 94. Chavis wrapping up the run here to the start finish line. New quick time for the 94, Brandon Chavis, 11 4 7 3. He poured it on there on lap number two, and it was enough. To bump Camden Harp off the top spot there, coming out of the final group, Braden Chavis will be leading him to green for the Junior 1 Max Daddy for 2024. Camden Harp from second, Raylan Morris, Caleb Nibel, Bladen Wheeler, your top five qualifiers. Junior 2, Max Daddy on track now for qualifying. All 21 carts will start the main here today. Lawson Bryant, cart 94, 11 3, 2, 0, early on. Top of the chart picks it up. 11 2, 6, 5, second lap around. That's going to be the best of them all in group one. Lawson Bryant with Ryan Sheffield, Parker Polozic, Jace Chance, Brody Warren. Your order through five of them. Bryson Smith showing the speed again here today. Going to the top of the speed chart. 11 one five, seven on the first lap. And a great pickup on lap two. Having a 10.956. Sitting top of the chart in junior two. Bryson Smith. Only sub 11 second lap on this one right now. 10.956 seconds. Sitting first. Foster Smithies in the 15 second. And John Hensley, 11 1 2 3, right now in third.
Another solid qualifying run here today for Aubrey Ice. The 88 machine goes third spot. Fastest of that group, 11-1-1-1. Through 15 qualifiers, it's still Bryson Smith by about a tenth and a half over second place Foster Smithies. Aubrey Ice, John Hensley, Grayson Underwood sitting fifth spot. Hudson Barrett, 94B, going to go fifth spot, 11.140. Now through 18 timers. Junior three, Max Daddy, should be making your way to the grid. You're next out, followed by the super heavy Max Daddy qualifier. Be getting ready. Again, once we complete qualifying, we're going to have our juice box main event. And then we'll have our two consies for the Max Daddy. If you do not qualify in the top 24, you will be eligible to run one of those two consies. And we'll run those after Juice Box. Cowboy Carter, eighth on his first lap around, 11.274. Carter to the checkered. He'll bump it up two spots to sixth. 11-1-6-1 for Cowboy Carter, fastest of that group. And that's going to do it for Junior 2 Max Daddy. Bryson Smith, 10.956, going to best that field. He'll earn the quick time here today. Talladega, Bryson Smith, Foster Smithy, second, Aubrey Ice, John Hensley, Hudson Barrett, your quick five. Six through ten was Cowboy Carter, Grayson Underwood, Lawson Bryant, Cruz Fudge, and Kyler Keith.
First group complete for the Junior 3 Max Daddy qualifying session. Jaden Cordell early on in the 317, 11 0 4 9, holding the top five. Got 24 drivers signed up for this one. We will start all 24 for the main event here. We will start all 24 cars. Logan Walston in the 56, third spot, first time around, 11.157. Second lap going to be good enough to go quickest, 10.939. Logan Walston, now fastest in junior three. That'll bump Jaden Cordell back to second. Daniel Cole to third. Regan Shulton, the 9S, fourth. Clay Bellamy right now, fifth. Super Heavy Max Daddy qualifies next. Need to be making your way to the grid. Super Heavy Max Daddy. Charlie Coger, card five. Vince Hochins in the 505. Dawson McClellan in the 80. And Riker Ridley in the 81 on track to take their times. Riker Ridley goes to seventh, first lap around, 11.234. And good pickup on lap two for Riker Ridley. He'll go all the way to third, 11.095 for the 81. Super Heavy need to be making your way in the grid. Super Heavy, next out. Super Heavy Max Steady qualifying, next out. Grayson Riddle coming around to complete his first lap. He'll go fourth on the board. 11-1-2-3. Been fast here all day long. Looking for just a little bit more in this one. Coming off turn four to the checkered. He'll go to second. 11-0-2-1. Wow, now Kyler Bronson going to go second. Great lap for the 40B. Kyler Bronson, 10.978. So Brunson to second, Riddle to third, Cooper Kitt to fifth. And we do have one more card scheduled to go here. See if they can find her down here on the grid. I don't think, don't think she's there, so I think that's going to do it. Logan Walston. 
will be your pole setter for the Junior 3 Max Daddy 2024. Second on the grid going to be Kyler Bronson, Grayson Riddle third, Jaden Cordell fourth, and Cooper Kidd fifth. Riker Ridley, Daniel Cole, Regan Shelton, Clay Bellamy, and Landon Gatlin will make up your top 10 starters for the Junior 3 Max Daddy. Super heavy Max Daddy qualifying coming on the racetrack next. Meet our Max Daddy drivers and crews getting those cards ready. Our final class to qualify here today. Coming up after Super Heavy, Max Daddy qualifying to set the field for that main event. And for those comsies, we will run two comsies for the Max Daddy class. Again, that'll be coming up after the Juice Box race. Juice Box, be getting your cards ready. You will run a main event coming up here after the Max Daddy qualifying session. Coming up just a couple classes from now. First group in the books for Stock Super Heavy. Time Bennett, quickest, 11.024. Just 22 thousandths over Mitch Hendricks, and Hendricks caught some traffic there on his second lap. Hurt the effort on the 505, still good enough for second in the first group. Hunter Scarborough, third. Renee Angel, fourth. And second group coming at you. To the green flag, going to be Bryce Overton in the 51, followed by Monk Newsom in 99, A.J. Pace in 88, Donnie Nall in cart 29, Wendell Chavis in the 94. First lap for Monk Newsom, new quick time, 11.004. Not so fast as Donnie Nall as he'll go quickest now. Donnie Nall, 10.921. Picks it up to an 887 on lap two. Disco Donnie Nall out of Lawsonville, North Carolina. Now fastest here in super heavy qualifying. Got a new quick mark in this one. Austin Wyatt in the 75 out of Emporia, Virginia. 10.866. Now for the new quick mark in Super Heavy. Ryan Hebner, card seven, going to go second on the board. 10.881. Bumping Donnie Nall back to third. Monk Newsom to fourth. And Wendell Chavis right now holding that fifth spot as we're now 14 drivers timed in. 14 of 28, and the next group coming to green.
Tim O'Connor, ninth spot on his first lap around, 11.071. Looking for some more here on lap number two. He'll get it. He'll go fourth on the chart, 10.934 for Tim O'Connor, fastest of that group. Rob Sanders in the 44, also into the top 10, make it seventh at a 10.983. Austin Wyatt still top of the chart, 10, 8, 6, 6. And this should be our final group coming here for qualifying for Super Heavy. Max Daddy qualifying is next. Looking for 46 carts and drivers down here to the grid. Max Daddy qualifying next on track. Let's be getting them down here. Mitchell Bridges, cart 15, along with Josh Carter, the 151. Cody Thomason, the 14T, making up this group. And looks like Josh Carter will be the best of this group. It's only going to be good enough for 16th spot overall, 11 2, two five for Carter. And that will do it. Stock super heavy for the Max Daddy. Going to go to the 75 of Austin Wyatt. Best of them in qualifying with a time. 10.886. Again, we will start all 28 carts for that one. Did have a few of you asking about that. Only class we're going to have Concies for here today. Going to be that Max Daddy class coming up here next. As I said, we've got 46 drivers going for 24 spots for the main. If you don't qualify in the top 24, if you're 25 on back, you will be eligible. We'll have you in one of those two Copsy lineups. We'll run the juice box main event here after we finish up qualifying. And give you Max Daddy drivers just a few minutes. If you do elect to run the Copsy, to get them turned back around and down here to the grid for those. We will run those two consoles before the main events here today. All right, here we go. Who's it going to be? 46 drivers for 24 spots. To set the field for the 2024 Max Daddy. Austin Yarbrough lays down a great lap in the first group. 10.585 by three and a half tenths. It's Yarbrough over A.G. Miller. Right now second with a time of 10.942. Hunter Adams, Braden Parsley, Jeremy Cox. The way they sit after group one. Juice Box, your main event is next. Let's have those ready. Juice Box. We will run that juice box main right here at the completion of Max Daddy qualifying. Juice box, have your carts ready. Daniel Armstrong going to jump to second, 10.895, but it's still Austin Yarbrough who's got him covered through two groups, still over three-tenths of a second. That'll be your new second-place man, Armstrong. A 5.85 for Yarbrough to an 8.95 for Armstrong with Cooper Quick, Mikey Kaiser, A.J. Miller sitting one through five. Juice box, have them ready. Your race is next.
Shay Chavis now second, make it third as Cameron Lambert going to go to second. Now Josh Darnell to the second spot. Good lap for Josh Darnell, 10.754. Still over a tenth and a half off that lap lead now by Yarbrough in that first group, 10-5-8-5. Still the one to beat. With now Darnell Lambert, Stephen Adams, and Shane Chavis making up your top five. How about Thomas Underwood going second on the board in the 801, 10.734 for Underwood. Only change in the top five there. Thomas Underwood out of Roanoke, Virginia, 10.734. Now second through 24 timers. That's still about a tenth and a half off that lap laid down by Yarbrough. I thought that was a good one, especially in that first group. So far, it has stood through 24 of them. Still got 22 timers to go here. And fastest 24 to the main. Bryson Murray into the show first lap, 10 spot, 10.915. Chase Williamson going to go sixth and a 10.782. Williamson jumps up the chart to third, 10.743, fastest to that group. Chase Williamson, leading money winner in all the go-kart racing for last year out of Lake City, South Carolina. Third spot, again, quickest of that last group at a 10 7 43. On the bubble now, Jennifer Seawright, 11 171. Now 29 drivers timed in. Again, qualifiers 25 through 46 of this. You will be eligible for one of those two consies. We'll run those here very shortly after we run that juice box race. Juice box, you're next. Juice box, you're next for your main event. Have them ready. Andrew Dove, 10th spot, first lap, 10-8-5-5. And Dove going to go to seventh out of 10 7 7 1. Andrew Dove into the show. Bryson Duncan right now, 23rd spot in danger of missing this one from the time of 11 0 4 0. Again, Barrett Terry not going to have enough. He's been having a tough day. Right now, 25th. Tristan Jones also not going to have enough to make the main event. Couple drivers in danger here: Justin Dobson, Bryson Duncan, Carson Holman, all right down here at the bubble spots. Bradley Carter, tenth on lap one, ten point seven nine five. Kaysen Sinclair all the way to second, 10.643 for the 41S. Kaysen Sinclair, now Bradley Carter going to go third. Oh, what a lap for Kaysen Sinclair, 10.643, going to be good enough for second. Bradley Carter, third. 
It's still Austin Yarbrough. Now by just about half a tenth. Sinclair got close there. A 58 for Yarbrough to a 64 for Sinclair. Still got, looks like 11 carts to go here. Jacob Nibel, 12th spot, first lap around, 10.796. And Nibel going to jump all the way to third, 10.669. That camp has showed a lot of speed here today. Jacob Nibel into the top three here. And that's going to put A.J. Miller on the bubble right now, sitting 24th, time of 10.942. Not making the main event here today. Hunter Adams, Jonathan Draper, Brandon Parsley, Brent Shelton, Carson Hallman. Bryson Duncan. The correction, we will be taking top 20 in time here for the Max Daddy. We will be taking top two finishers from each Kotze to make up that 24-card field. So top 20 for qualifying here, and then we'll take the top two finishers from each Kotze. And those Kotze's are going to be coming up here pretty quick, guys. We're getting ready to run this juice box race, then we're going to be looking to run those Kotze's before we start main events here today. Again, top 20 from time. We'll make the main here for the Max Daddy, 21 through 46. We'll go to the Concies. We'll take the top two from each Concie to make the 24 cart main. To make it Cooper quick on the bubble now, 20th spot, 10.907. That's going to bump A.J. Miller, Daniel Simmons, Blake Wynn, Mikey Kaiser. Austin Banker just squeaks into the show first lap, 19th spot, 10.891. Tyler Blossick, 16th at a 10.833. That's it. That's it. And that will do it for the Max Daddy qualifying. It is going to be Austin Yarbrough leading that field to green for the 2024 edition. Went out in the very first group at that time, stood through all of them. 10.585 was what it took there for Yarbrough. That'll do it for qualifying here today. We're getting ready to run our juice box main event coming up next on the racetrack. We should have those guys and gals down here on the grid just about ready to go. We'll get our youngsters out here for their track time. Let you guys that are going to run the Conti's for the Max Daddy. Again, if you qualified in spots 21 on back, we took the top 20 on time. If you qualify 21 through 46, you'll be slotted in one of these two Consies coming up here in just a few minutes. And we will take the top two finishers out of each Consi to make up the rest of that 24 cart main event for the Max Daddy. So if you qualify 21 on back, be getting those parts ready for your Consi. If you elect to run, we're not going to be waiting for those down here on the grid once we call you. We're going to be taking what we get down here for the Consies. All right, last call on the racetrack for the Juice Boxers. Let's get our Juice Boxers on the racetrack. Last call for your race. And if we can get all of our quick time award winners here for the day, to go see them over there at the Maxis trailer for your pole awards, please. If you earned a pole position here today, they've got your fast time awards down here at the Maxis trailer. I'd like to see you down here to pick those up ASAP. Getting last call down here on the racetrack for the Juice Boxers for your main event, Juice Box.
Steady Conti drivers be getting ready as we're getting ready to go green flag racing here on the racetrack. Our juice boxer, there it is. Green is out. We've already got some trouble here. Oh, we got one. Halfway spun around there. Get it back going. The leader is checked out in the battles for second. Got a good group of them here today. Always great to see. These radio flyer carts. Well, look at that. We're three wide there for about fourth. Slicing and dicing down to turn three. I'll say good show from about second on back. Got a healthy lead out here at the front. And check it out as they'll slide them and crash them across the start finish line. Got to have a little fun, right? All right, we'll get some pictures with these guys down here on the front straightaway. We're going to be looking for our Concy drivers for the Max Daddy here very shortly. Again, if you earned a pole position here today, they want to see you over there at the Maxis trailer to pick up your pole award. And if you would, please hang out for the group photo. All pole award winners, please come see us at the Maxis trailer. And Concy drivers to lock in those final four spots for the Max Daddy. Be getting those cars ready for those races. <laughs> 